Hi, I'm Isabella Wojcik, Director of House Programming at the James Beard Foundation, and I'm really excited to show you a great recipe. It's called Chipino, and it is um, essentially a fish stew, a seafood stew. It originates in San Francisco when all the Italian immigrants uh, brought forth their heritage. So it's a tomato-based, uh, deliciously flavored, light, healthy seafood stew from San Francisco, um, one of James Beard's favorites. Let's get started. First step of the chipino is to sweat some vegetables in olive oil. So I have in here onions, garlic, green bell peppers, cremini mushrooms. I cook them for a few minutes and then I'm going to add the tomatoes. So layering in some fresh colors and flavors. And what I love about this recipe is all of the ingredients are available year round. So you can make this anytime the mood strikes you. The next step is for me to make the broth, which I will then use to cook all of the seafood for this stew. So to my vegetables, I'm going to add my mussel broth. Previously, I cooked mussels in white wine and then strained off and reserved the liquid. I'm also going to add vegetable stock. Certainly if you have fish or seafood stock, that would be great as well. And tomato paste. And tomato paste is just this great concentrate. It's a tremendous amount of flavor. It's gonna boost my tomato flavor in this stew. After 15 minutes, this is what my broth braised vegetables look like. Now I'm going to add to that uh, the bass. The fish was two fillets cut into two, so I'm actually having four portions. What I love about this step and what you're looking at is this rich, flavorful liquid, full of flavor, full of vegetables, and really an elegant way to braise fish. We're going to cover this and let it cook on its own for about five minutes. After braising the fish, I also added raw shrimp and half the cooked mussels. And in just a couple of moments, they all cook through. And to finish, the most exciting part, I'm gonna add the remaining cooked mussels on the shell. It creates a really dramatic presentation. I'm going to add also my chopped parsley for color. Stir, and you're ready to serve. And I'm gonna ladle out, portion it into four or two if you're extra hungry. You want to show that fish on top. Just a couple of pieces of big flat, um, flat leaf parsley and some slices of baguette. And you're ready to enjoy. Nice glass of wine and you're good to go.